Earlier today, agents escorted Corporal Jose Luis Espericueta Jr.'s body from the forensic center to a funeral home in Edinburgh after he was killed while answering a call for a domestic dispute. Good evening, I'm Maribel Gonzalez, in for Nicole Hickel and Chris Jacobs. During this time of tragedy, some locals are providing Espericueta's family with consolation. The 100 RGV is an organization helping loved ones of law enforcement killed or injured while in the line of duty. CBS 4 Sandra Garcia is live with more on the 100 Club of the RGV's efforts. Sandra. The support we've seen from a number of people today is overwhelming, and the 100 Club of the RGV says it's the least they can do after Officer Espericueta paid such a sacrifice. The funds we collect are essentially for the worst case scenario, and, and we find ourselves in that situation now. Following the loss of Corporal Jose Luis Espericueta, there's been an outpour of support for his family. Corporal Espericueta lives behind his wife, Bobby, and two children. The 100 Club of the RGV is just one organization collecting donations after Thursday night's tragedy. Nothing we can do, nothing we can give can replace uh, the loss of life, especially you know, with, with a hero who is out there protecting us, um, like uh, Corporal Espericuerta. Um, but in some way, this is our way of giving back. It's money that they raise year round, but never did they think they'd have to use it this way. It's just the least we could do to help them. I mean, they, they sacrifice so much for us. This is just a little bit of what we can do to give back to them. And the support goes for Espericueta's family in uniform too. I would also like to thank all of our federal, state, county and law enforcement partners who assisted us last night and who continue to stand by us in our time of need. As you can see here today, my colleagues, my friends are here with us today. Those at the Mission Police Department who lost a brother in blue. We're here to do anything and everything we can uh, to help out not only um, the, the family of the fallen officer, but his police family as well. The brothers and sisters at the Mission Police uh, Department who stood by him and are suffering just as much as the family. For more information on how you can donate, you can find the 100 Club's website on valleycentral.com, as well as an option to donate at your local First Community Bank. Live in Mission with complete Valley coverage, Sandra Garcia, CBS4 Valley, tonight.